we use the patti index to create the bevel this patti index we made with the help of the wax up in the tooth now you can mark it with the sharp instrument any probe any sharp instrument the margin now apply the cell uh, teflon tape to adjacent teeth and i'm using viva pen here for bonding agent rubbing for 20 second is very important then air dry it with the moisture free air until you see any movement in the bonding layer I am using a blue face power cure light here <coughs> then with the help of this putty index we will make a palatal shell with the chosen enamel composite which we choose spread it with the help of our scalpel pad up to the mark which we made now place it to the tooth structure and with the help of brush see that it, it, it joins tooth properly then light cure it now the palatal shell is ready check it there is there is no bubble in the palatal shell now to make the mesial wall apply the sectional matrix posterior sectional matrix stabilize it with the wedge if wedge is loose take the wider wedge this metal strip should not move now take the same enamel composite make a thin wall side mesial wall you can use this composite gently with the help of any instrument and with the help of brush make it uniform smooth and nice make it thinner and remove the axis so that the this we can save the time while now you can hold this to the tooth and cure it sectional matrix now we have the palatal shell and the matrix to secure the palatal shell with the tooth just apply a very thin layer of flowable composite then apply dentin it's snow plow technique so that there will be no voids while we are applying the dentin composite merge it with the tooth uh, take see that your composite dentin composite will cross the broken part of the tooth and make some room for that uh, incisal composite make the lobes with a thin instrument cure it as you can see there is a broken part in the palatal shell we can repair with the help of putty index very easily just apply the putty index and very take very thin enamel composite spread it gently very thin layer and then cure it now we are applying the incisal composite transfer the translucent composite more translucent composite merge the composite with the help of brush the brush is the very helpful tool now trans opel i am using trans opel here then the enamel final enamel composite spread it uniformly 
So I magnifying it to remove the excess composite, merging it properly. The video is in a little bit higher speed to reduce the time of the video. Or light cure all around 20-20 second buckle palatal. Now we apply the glycerin jelly doing oxygen inhibition all over the composite which you have done. So I will explain the finishing polishing in episode 3.